Welcome to this Enterprise DNA Power BI sh uh, Partner Showcase solution around inventory management. So if you're a, an organization which sells products through a range of different warehouses, you obviously need to manage your inventory extremely effectively, not only to manage the, the cash which is held up in your inventory, but also making sure that you are stocked well enough for the trends in sales that you might be seeing uh, through your retail outlets or through your uh, sales people, etc. So this showcase is all about managing your inventory, finding insight into your inventory in an, in an almost real-time basis. So in the inventory overview, we're looking at uh, um, inventory value by product we stock, by item, and what we can do is we can actually navigate and see, well, where, where is this stock actually held? And if we work through these different inventory uh, values, we can see the dynamic change in the other visuals. But we can also do is we can actually drill in to say what 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 do we have in our particular in a particular warehouse? We can actually click in the warehouse and then see the change up in terms of uh, the values just for that warehouse and and also we have some information on our vendors here as well. We have some key information down our side down the side here. The key one of the key ones being is our reorder products. So we want to we want to walk in every day and see uh, which products or what, what inventory values are below their thresholds for reordering. And you may have these thresholds uh, var varied across your different range of products just based on uh, the speed with which it can take to get, bring in. So these, um, these reorder products calculations will enable you to understand, okay, which products do we need to go in and order up uh, right now so that we have it in stock for when we need to make a sale. Here we analyze some sales performance. So we're analyzing here how sales is performed over time. And this is obviously very important because you wanna understand well, how are certain products selling and are we stocking enough of them? Or do we have too much, far too much stock based on the sales trends that we're actually seeing in the market? So we can click through any particular name. We can see, well, this is how the trends are performing. We can actually see the, um, the revenue uh, per day on a moving average basis to try and smooth that out just to really identify trends. And then we're also comparing that to say uh, last year. We could also reconfigure this to do that versus budget, etc. Then we're looking uh, at our customers. So what are our customers actually buying? So are, what are our customers buying and how fast are they actually buying? it? Uh, are, are they buying a similar amount to what they were purchasing last year? So are our forecasts right, etc. These are the sort of questions that you can answer with this sort of analysis. And if we dive more into our inventory, so here we can actually see, well, what is the total inventory value we have versus the total revenue we're actually uh, obtaining for these particular products? And as you can see, these are the these are our worst performing products because we hold way too much inventory for how much we're selling. So we might want to change up our strategy there. We might want to sell uh, sell some of these products at a discount, at a steep discount, etc. And similarly, here we have this more more from a, on a quantity basis. So how much room has been taken up by stock, which we just can't sell, and we need to somehow get rid of it, somehow uh, focus in on those poor performing uh, product lines or, or items and, and, and somehow move them on. Here we have a bit of, uh, bit of analysis on each individual product, uh, total, total stock sales versus total inventory on hold. And you can actually drill into each specific uh, product and actually see a bit more information in the tooltip there. Lastly, we have our warehouse inventory stock take. So you can actually click through any grouping or any item and you can actually see, well, where is this item held in our inventory? So in our, uh, sorry, in our warehouses. And you can actually click multiple items and you can see some information down here in terms of the vendor, the, the name of the item, obviously, the total stock inventory, the reorder quantity, the total inventory value, uh, days it takes for an order to come back uh, from a vendor when we order it, and how old is inventory. So all this is just absolutely key information um, to know uh, almost in real time so that you can understand exactly the position um, of your uh, inventory at, at, at any point in time. You don't want to, to be having to go and count up what is in the warehouse or in all your specific warehouses uh, every day or every week to make sure that you're gonna have enough stock based on the, uh, the, the trending sales that you might be having. So that is the inventory management uh, Power BI showcase, huge amount of information captured in this uh, one, uh, one Power BI model and incredible how you can dynamically move between or drill into this very specific information that you might want to 
uh, based on your not only your inventory but also your sales.